Businesses nationwide, big and small, are struggling. Gold's Gym is one of the latest companies to take a hit from the coronavirus pandemic. It filed for Chapter 11 bankruptcy today. WFMY News 2's Adoria Chumba has the details on what is next for the fitness center chain. Gold's Gym CEO says that he hopes that by filing for Chapter 11 bankruptcy, the company will come back stronger. Now, only company operated gyms will be affected by the bankruptcy, according to a statement from the company. Those locations make up about 10% of the company's roughly 700 locations worldwide. Gold's Gym said challenges caused by the coronavirus pandemic led to the decision. Now, starting in late February into early March, gyms and fitness centers, amongst other non-essential businesses, were shut down nationwide under various state executive orders in order to limit the spread of the coronavirus. In March, late March, Gold's Gym permanently closed 30 locations, including one in Winston-Salem. Now, in the statement, CEO Adam Zaitsev said the bankruptcy will not affect locally owned franchise gyms. A UNCG business expert says to expect more businesses to take a hit like this one. I think what will happen is that there will be a, a sort of tidal wave of bankruptcies in the months forthcoming. Some will be because of the pandemic, others will be because of bad business practices even before the pandemic began. Again, this bankruptcy will only affect company-owned and operated gyms. Now, this one behind me here on Wendover Avenue in High Point is a franchise operation and is expected to open up in late May, according to a staff member.